<gasps> Hello there. Tell me, do you know about cats? They've got cute ears that wiggle and twitch. Tails that respond to their emotions. All attached to a human-like creature of the utmost charm. Does that pique your interest? If they sound appealing to you, please visit our patisserie. We have the cutest cats you've ever seen, all waiting to serve you. Hi and welcome to the Patisserie La Soleil. Part of our instincts as cats. Yeah, but you were just needing Chocolat's tummy. Good point. Hi. Hey there, you're finally awake. That's right. Meowing, Master. Good morning, Master. Morning. Nice to see you. See for yourself. It's bacon and eggs. Wow. Oh, yay! That's Chocolat's favorite! Go and wash up, Kay. It's almost time to eat. Kay! Oh, hey, use the sink. It looks great! Vanilla! It's super duper 
super yummy. Master's cooking is always the best, isn't it? Chocola, you shouldn't talk while eating. That is incredibly rude. <laughs> it's hard to believe, but cats grow up so fast. When we found them back home, <laughs> they couldn't even use chopsticks properly. But now look at them. They're even big enough to help out with my shop. I have to admit, I was rather surprised when they showed up as unexpectedly as they did. Uh, what's up with these massive boxes? They look like they were mailed from home. Well, guess I'd better open them up. <laughs> uh... Oh, but then again, it's probably not very smart to open a package when I wasn't expecting it. The delivery guy must have made a mistake. Better send it back. Uh, yeah, I think I'll go call them right now. Afternoon! <sighs> uh, hi. So, uh, surprise, it was Chocola inside the box. Long time no see, huh? What? I literally just saw you at home yesterday. <sighs> Bet I know who's in the other box. I go where Chocola goes. Everywhere I'll always be by her side. So, was this Shigure's idea? <sighs> shop and live alone I did not talk to Shigure uh, I really wanted to stay with you so she did not come up with a plan and I most certainly did not hide inside the moving boxes so I could just show up and live with you out of the blue because that would be totally crazy are you sure sounds like a confession <sighs> <sighs> all right get out of the moving box we'll discuss the rest later spoiler alert I obviously let them stay with me I just have a soft spot for cats hey master hmm you haven't eaten your bacon or eggs yet. Can Chocolat have them? No, ma'am. Uh, yep, yeah, he's going to give them to me instead. I'm gonna give them to me. <sighs> What's up, Shigure? Noticing how great you are at cooking. Duh! After all, I cook breakfast pretty much every single day. Of course I'd be good at it. That's true. It was a compliment, okay? So, is there anything I can do to help you? Oh, I'm fine. I've totally got this. Besides, we set up a schedule to have us cats make breakfast, remember? Oh, yeah, that's a pretty good point. Still, though... I know. Why don't you go and give Nuts a hand? What's she doing exactly? I'm making sure the rice cooker doesn't mess up the rice. Uh, yeah. You know how dangerous it is to give coconut a knife, right? Are you ready, fish? Prepare to die! <gasps> uh-huh. After that, I decided to give her a safer assignment. Right. Probably for the best. Hmm. you or anything, but I gotta... I really gotta... I heard you already. Can you please stop pouting me so much? Hurry! I don't know how much longer I can hold it. Come on, my eyeballs are practically floating. Jeez, there... <laughs> uh... Honestly, Cinnamon's out here doing the potty dance every single morning. It sucks. I wonder if she could have messed up her toilet training. <sighs> Delicious! Azuki really outdid herself today, huh? What about me? I helped too. You sure did. Okay, thanks for the food. Yes, yes thank, thank you. you. Let's, Let's dig, dig in. in. <laughs> As always, our cats are full of energy. Whoops, I almost forgot. I hope Chocola and Vanilla are both doing okay at the shop. All done. <laughs> How's it going? You about ready to open? Yep, ready and willing. We're all set. Great. Let's go ahead and open everything up. I'm counting on your help today. Right. Yes. 
Just leave it to us. Well then, that's the last of the laundry. Oh. They say that sleeping children grow fast, but I think that she could slow down a little. Sorry, I couldn't help myself. Uh, blame it on instinct? <sighs> huh? What's wrong? You wanna fight? <sighs> Come on, May! Hurry up! Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. Two at it again. Well, what can you do? There's no time for watching fights. Please hurry up. We need to get going. <laughs> Look, I really hate rushing you all the time, but we're like super behind schedule as it is. You just had to change your panties, didn't you? <gasps> hmm. I don't know why you're complaining. If you hadn't taken so long in the bathroom, I wouldn't have wet myself. Oh, uh, uh, well, let's just go already. <laughs> Sure are. Leaving their house with their little bells. How impressive. <laughs> Hold on. They can only leave their house if they wear a bell? Is that what you mean? Exactly right. Usually, cats aren't allowed to leave their house unless their master is with them. But if they're wearing a bell, then they're allowed to be out all on their own. I think I understand. In order for a cat to get a bell, they have to pass a test. It's very difficult. I see. So then those cats over there must be super smart. Bye-bye, mm -hmm. kitties! <laughs> There's no time for waving. Come on, we're already running late. Jeez, uh. Maple and Cinnamon need to hurry. They sure are taking their sweet time. If they don't get here soon, then Shakla will get dizzy with a grumbling, hungry stomach! Sure is complaining a lot. It's so cute. Uh, huh. Wow, what an adorable shop. Yeah, I know, right? Hi, and welcome. Please allow me to seat you. Thank you for waiting. Here are the four limited edition melting puddings that you asked for. I'm not saying that the cat who seated us wasn't cute, but that white cat is adorable too. Yeah, they're both super cute. Thank you so much for waiting. Here's the fruit tart you ordered, ma'am. Oh my! It looks yummy! Uh, excuse me. So, um, would you like to have a little bite? Oh, wow! Well, are you sure? <laughs> I don't mind. Okay. Uh... <laughs> I'm very sorry. Unfortunately, we have a strict policy against the employees accepting food from our customers. Oh, I understand. Yeah! Maple and Cinnamon are so late, I'll starve before they finally get here! Come on! Hurry up, May. I am hurrying. And almost finished. Done. We look perfect. Hey, we're here! I'm sorry that we're running so late. Oh, thank goodness. Would you mind relieving the other two cats for a quick break? I'm worried about Chocola. It's taking everything she has not to pounce on that customer's dessert. Hi, and welcome. We're, We're so, so happy, happy to have you at Patisserie La Soleil. A table for two? Does this spot work okay for you ladies? <sighs> Here, say ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Oh. <laughs> How cute! I'm kind of jealous. <sighs> okay, say ah. Oh. 
It's okay, it was only a few minutes. And honestly, I'm just happy to have the extra help, so I appreciate you. <laughs> In that case, Shakala will do her best to emulate Master's kindness and will also forgive you. <gasps> Thank you! Oops, I meant to tell all of you. When I got here, I put seared tuna in the upstairs refrigerator. It's supposed to be for dinner tonight. Huh? Seared tuna? <laughs> That's right, Shigure asked us to give it to you. She said because she wanted her brother and his cats to have it. I guess she just wants to make sure everyone's well fed, huh? Yay! I'm so excited! Shakala adores tuna! <sighs> yeah, me too. Slap some ponzu vinegar on top of it and it's like my favorite thing. <sighs> Something wrong? Shigure asked us to bring some ponzu vinegar as well, but I forgot it back at the house. You guys have ponzu here, don't you? No, I don't think I do, actually. It's okay, we could just use soy sauce. <gasps> you can't! It'd be such a waste of that delicious tuna! I know! What if Shakala went out and bought some? Uh... Don't worry, Shakala will be super fast and she'll be back before you know it! <laughs> See ya! Don't start without me! Uh, <laughs> hold on! My Shakala's always so full of energy, huh? Wish I could bottle some of her stamina. I'm actually kind of envious. I'll have to be sure to compliment her when she comes back home. Wait, Master. Uh. I volunteer to compliment her. Okay. Ponzu, Ponzu. Shakala's gonna go buy you. Put you on some too. Huh? Cool. Time for a shortcut. <laughs> <laughs> when Shakala gets back home, Master will surely shower her with a ton of praise. Who knows? He might even play with Shakala using some new toys. And maybe Vanilla will want to groom Shakala's hair after a bath. Tonight. Oh, I can't wait. All right then. Increasing speed. Go. nearby or something? Um, is that a no? Okay then, can you tell me your address? Do you maybe live in this area? Finish asking. 
If you had a quick bite with some soy sauce, then I know Chocola would definitely hold it against you. Uh, yes, that would be very likely. <laughs> to come and pick her up? Yeah, that's probably what it was. Plus, Chocola can't think of another reason why a cat without a bell on would be outside all by themselves. <laughs> Thank you. 